Alright guys, it's time for Thomas to do his job and back. Alright, so we need to make sure that these, uh, streets are protected. I got my new group 6 FPIU, this thing is gorgeous. So beautiful. They really did an amazing job on this, this here, group 6, uh, at, uh, to afford the interceptor. Uh, yes, very, so nice. Group I set, set on the side. Come on, sir, I'm gonna turn right. Sir, I need to turn right on red, please. There's the police car out there. Oh. See, I wish I could have been the police. I think I'd have made a pretty, really pretty awesome police officer. But it's just, I don't know. I think it's a stressful job. I don't know if I can handle that kind of stress. This is stressful making sure all the security is done correctly over here. So, yep, that's right. That's for sure, Thomas can take care of everything. It's a beautiful night outside. That, that moon just looks so nice. Oh, that's awesome. This? What's hey, you keep your mouth, doing here? Keep your mouth shut, yeah? That's the red dot. Uh, it's should we go poke wait. him? Yeah, go. Yeah. Do you know what, let's be friends. Let's forget about what happened, okay? Let's go poke fun at this guy. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that together. Hi, gentlemen. Look at this fake ass bitch. What? Red what? Why you guys gotta be yeah, rude? How's, how's it going? My name's Thomas. Jesus Christ, he's spitting on me. I'm not spitting Boom. on you, sir. I'm, I'm, the cops. 
Is everything Jesus okay, God. sir? Oh, please, you need to get him a COVID mask. What, what, what are those gloves? Sweet Jesus. They're mechanic He's gloves, sir. The Listen, is like, everything God. safe? I'm gonna do a building search, sir, uh, cause that's what I'm hired to do. No, you're not. I wouldn't, I wouldn't trust him going around my building. Uh -huh. He'll probably get his you know joints and Let's go to the door, hang on. You should go inside. What the fuck? Why is what? there so many lights on a security car? Gentlemen, if you could stay away from my car, please. Can you not push me out of the way, please? I just need to get in my car, sir. No, you need to keep your mouth shut because you're spitting on me every time you say something. Sir, my window's up. I don't know how you can hear me, sir. At the car. Look, it's got it's got window bars in it, my man. Like, what are we gonna be arresting? It's a Christmas tree. What the fuck is that? I like got beaten. You know what? This cost me fifty thousand dollars. So you know, what? don't don't go. With that cost you fifty grand. Yeah. <laughs> you scam, I'm boy. actually afraid. That, I'm actually afraid one of them is gonna steal my uh, SUV. How much is this? Oh shit! Sixty-eight grand. That's that's real fancy. Alright, gentlemen, you have a nice night. This is having a sense of... <laughs> That's very rude, sir. You don't have to make fun of me, jeez. Do I have a ride? Can you close your store for five minutes? Well, I gotta secure the good if you know what I mean. Yeah, you secure it, I'll wait here. Thomas is back. Start this car park here. This group six patrol around here. I wish these guys would pick up, Keats. Hello? Hi there, this, uh, this is Chris within the uh, police department. Yes, uh, hello, my name's Thomas. I'm down here at the LCD at 1996 Davis Avenue. Um, I work for Group A6. Um, like I said, my name's Thomas Longford. And there's uh, two gentlemen here and they're in a black car and they're driving crazy. 
and they almost uh, ran into a pole. Uh, they almost hit the gas station, and they're just acting crazy out here. Okay, you say it's a black car. Did you get another description of the vehicle at all, sir? It's, uh, it's like one of them black, uh, GTSs. Uh, it's, it's a two-door. I'm not too good with cars, uh, sir. Okay, what I'll do, um, are you sa in a safe location, Mr. Uh, Mr. Longford? Yes, I'm, I'm in, I'm out, well, I'm outside of my group A6 FPIU, but I'm at the Mega Mall. I'm safe. Oh. Okay, there, uh, Miss Longford. What I'll do, I'll have a, I'll have a unit come down and have a look at the, have a look in the area, and we'll stop the people driving de uh, dangerously for yourself, sir. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. No problem, Miss Longford. You have a great day now. Okay. Thank you for calling. Name one one. Yes, sir. Slash start fire and I think ten and then whatever size you want. Sir, you're gonna kill somebody. Stop. You're gonna kill Good somebody, way. you idiot! Stop it! That's just ridiculous. Where's the police? Get out of this parking lot, you rude mother... Leave! Oh my goodness. It's ripped for... Oh, jeez. Guys, get out of the parking lot. You're gonna kill each other. Oh, jeez. Yes. There's the cops. Get him, get him. That's him. This guy made Thomas mad. Guys, gonna get it.
Hey, 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 stop. Get that guy, he's bad. Stop. Idiots. That's what you get, stupid. Yeah, and do you know what lights and sirens mean? You know what, I'm carrying on, how dare you hit my car? Hey sir, you, no, you're, sir, you're being stupid, stop it! I will save you, you son of a gun! Stop it! Do not move! Ah! Stop ramming my vehicle! He's, he's trying to taste me. He's trying to hurt people. Just like his idiot friends over here. Jesus. Officer, he's trying to taste me. Yes, because no, you're an idiot. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Sir, get out of the cart. Get out of it now and put your hands up. That's look, right. Look at this man. And he's the one chasing me. That's because you're acting right. a fool. He's a security officer, and this is but he ch pretty chased me on active secure. roadways. Hands up. He chased me on active roadways. And I will discuss that with them, but I need you to put your hands up so I can do medical attention on the behind me. All right, all right, all right. Right, you, you detain that one. I got this. You gotta listen to the law, young man. Knees. Gotta listen to the law. Please away from me. Get on your knees. What, what do you want, officer? I don't want another squeaker over here talking so over from me. Get on your knees. You tell him, officer. You do it. If you I, I, you're gonna get teased, understand? That's more like a gun to me, but okay. I know, I just swapped to a teaser. This idiot over here done hurt himself. Shot him like an idiot. Why you gotta be so rude? I stand up. Alright, let me get up. Oh. <laughs> Thomas! Oh no, Thomas is gonna get killed one of these days. Uh, let's see. My vehicle is not. Okay, let's walk to this vehicle over here. Go my vehicle. Right, this time you're not under arrest. You're... Oi, over here. Don't try to be funny with me. At this time, you're not under arrest. You're just being detained for further investigation. Do you understand? Alright, sir, can you hear me? Hi. Okay, face the vehicle <sighs> back. I'm gonna search you right now, okay? Ah. I'm gonna be searching you for my safety and yours. Do you have anything on you that's gonna poke me, stick me, or stab me, or hurt me? Wait. I, I got combat pistol. Okay, so where's that combat pistol? At? He's dangerous. My waistband. Alright, is is there one in the chamber or is it not loaded? It's uh fully loaded, but safety's still on. Oh. Is there one? Why did you do that, sir? 
you were failing. Uh, I can't you were hear you. Uh, you like... I oh. lit you up and hit the sirens. You were drifting around the park. Can we, can we move failure. Away? I it called it out as a vehicle pursuit. Vehicle pursuit. I know. Stay very still. You were. You somehow managed to end outside of the vehicle when I hit. When we ended up colliding. I went to get out and then you flattened me. And now, you see. Uh, the problem with the story sir, is we were inside the vehicle when I when I hit the car the second time. That's what I saw. So you ended up on the side of it, on. unless you weren't wearing your seatbelt. Right, medics are arriving. I'm gonna get you to hospital, and then I'm gonna have to pat with you. All right. Damage two nice cars, man. Your boss ain't gonna be happy. You hit your child and ruined it. Oh no, I'm. I can get to do he's not gonna happen considering this is the second challenger I've been in today. Uh oh, you're fucked. <laughs> no kidding. But again, the first challenger did help me catch the person who uh, tried to kill my boss. So. Oh, we might be on that one, I don't know. Anyway, sir, the ambulance is gonna take you away. He's got a broken leg. Uh, butterfly. I did butterfly bandages to the head to keep the cash together, put gauze on it, and it's gonna need some stitches there. Hey, All right, can sir. you tell that story? And he didn't walk on the road, so I was behind him, and he was going through red lights right, so 100 miles an hour, pretending he's a cop. Right. Uh, I'll put them on the uh, put and, here, and so I'll have a discussion with him about pertaining to his jurisdiction, which is uh, this parking hey. lot. I you think. can check my mirror cam. These cars are built in mirror cams, right, and sir. it shows him very well. Following you around? Yeah, I saw him on the road before you came back in this parking lot, and began something. doing some pretty cool drifts from the poles. How's it going, sir? I let you up for that, to what's, be honest. What's up, my man? So, you got a nice, uh, nice security right. car there. Yes, thank you. They just, uh, they just came out with their new livery. Right, it looks really away. nice on that vehicle. I should say so myself. <laughs> Thomas is the man. Stop two men that were drifting in the parking lot. <laughs> Thomas. Yeah. <laughs> Thomas might have a list, but he is a, a G yes, a <laughs> G type security guard. Yeah, basically, uh, I found I found a, he had a gun on him, round in the chamber. So I'm I'm checking the pinaco to see if there's anything about that. Stand up. The the police to secure that. Yeah, I, I'm searching the serial number and everything. All right. All right. Uh, security guard. Uh, do you care yes, to tell me why you were on the road with your vehicle? Okay, so I, 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 I know I'm not supposed to do that, and I, I'm sorry, but see, here's what happened. So, I was doing my security business at the LTD over there, and uh, those two gentlemen over there, they were, you know, they were talking to each other, and, uh, you know, they were making fun of me, and whatnot, and then after that, I, you know, came over into this parking I lot, uh, I got, I, and, I got your wallet here. And uh, then after that, uh, the, the guy that, that, that uh, uh, ran from you there. Uh, he uh, he he started drifting all over the parking lot. So then I called 911 on the cell phone, uh, cause my radio's busted. Uh, so I called 911, and uh, then the guy in the black car took off, and then his buddy came in here and he almost hit me with his uh, little his little three wheeler, and he was doing the same thing. Mm -hmm. So I tried to get him to stop. 
and then he went out onto the road and started driving super crazy. So I was trying to get him to stop so he didn't hurt anyone in this sense. No, and I understand that. But you understand the you understand the problem I have is as a private security officer, you legally cannot light up and chase people on the street. That's considered reckless. Yes, it's, it, uh, I, I, I know it was one of those situations where, um, you know, I, I know I had control of my vehicle. That I have dash cam in there as well if you want to take a look at that. But uh, when that, there's two individuals, that one, no one that's in that uh, FBIU over there, just causing a ruckus and, and, you know, making it hard for people just to live their lives out here. Um, you know, who knows what they were doing at the LTD. Um, but in your case, uh, you know, you might want to search that vehicle too, because that guy just seems sketchy. I don't know about him. But uh, he was driving all over the place and going in and out of the parking lots and, uh, you know, drifting around. He almost hit the these two gangster looking guys walking across the road. Uh, I slowed down to, to let them pass and make sure they were okay and they were safe, but uh, it was pretty bad. Alright, you know, since you were sort of in a predicament in which you were at some point in time what I noticed being chased by these people and being harassed yes, by them. Yes, sir. What I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a second clue. Uh, that will mean you're not going to get money on your record, which will mean you, you'll still have your job with good sense. Awesome. And, but I will need to see your I will need to see your license. Okay, sir. Here you go. Here's my license and uh, also my uh, my group six uh, security uh, badge. Uh, my name's Thomas Alrighty. Longford. Yes, sir. So what? Um, did the individual that's in the uh, the PD car over there, did he at any point of time when you obviously pointed your weapon and advised that he has a weapon? No, if, um, okay, the I'll get him for group the group six info. guy was hollering something at me. Uh, he was hollering at me, but he did run over my vehicle. It is for right. my vehicle making contact with that gentleman over there's vehicle. Uh, by the way, the gentleman over there is in the hospital well. with his with being a C zero scan. Uh, I'm going to have go him with the charges and have county pick him up from there. All right, sounds good. Uh, but yeah, my vehicle to make contact with him twice. Uh, once when I was attempting to turn around and get behind him again, uh, he drifted around a pole and he collided with the rear end of my vehicle. Time How around again, reckless was this guy going? Super reckless. Um, he, he, like reckless sure endangerment he misdemeanor or reckless endangerment felony? To be a felony, I, I mean, would he say. He ramped my vehicle at a pretty, big, and I bet you this guy has a dash cam that you can check out for that. Yes, sir, I do. Uh, well, uh, I'll check the Mega Mall one as well to see. Uh, yeah, see, he almost killed two, uh, two. Well, they were gangsters, but he still almost killed them both. Because he was driving oh, crazy. Free. This officer isn't not doing anything. Hey, my <laughs> boy. I'll, I'll need you to do me a quick favor. Uh, try to yeah. find a, a security guard inside and uh, ask to see a security footage of the entire parking lot of what happened. Yep. No Alright, thanks, man. Hello, sir. Bud. Bud. Do me a favor and just step out of the vehicle real quick. Alright, sit tight, Mr. Long. Okay, just open the door for me. Okay. Right, let's walk to the other. Please, so damn loud. Please, just inside of the vehicle. I'm gonna punch you down one more time, okay? Good job, Thomas. <laughs> uh, no, I just, uh, just wanted to. Do, I'll tell you the uh, the reason real quick. Just happened. Oh, oh wrong side. Hey. 
You can do it. Get the fucking hand. Uh, you can do it. No. I kinda. No. My head kinda. Okay, I kinda. Okay. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Let, let, me, let me try. Um. Alrighty, Mr. Blankford. Okay, I'm gonna put you on this side, but I need you Stop to a citation for you. go to it's the other side, if you know what I mean. It's a Mr. Citation. Okay, I'll just scooch one, over. It is a $1,000 citation, but it means it won't show up on your record as an arrest. It won't well, show up on your really record. Well, you can't really show up because it's wall. I should so not. I'll need you to should not jump over. Anyway, uh, conduct uh, negatively oh. towards your employment status. Okay, I sh I'm sorry, sir. It was just one of those situations where. Um, the, you guys didn't get here fast enough, and I thought these guys were dealing drugs, and, you know, they were drifting around, making fun of me in the parking lot, and then they took it to the street. I was like, oh, Lord, they're gonna kill people. And there's a guy in the black car over there, he started to chase me, and then I was scared for my life. No, but I, I understand, understand. That. That's sort of why I'm, sort of why I'm oh, doing well, this way. I'm move over. I understand that you're working in a tough yeah, area, to move over, a man. rather really tough situation today. I could get, just get your signature on the bottom. It's not a minute guilt. It's just that you've received this and have made note of the court date. There you go, sir. Here is your copy, your ID, and your security badge back. Uh, hang around. I awesome. wait for you to leave. We may have a couple more questions for you. Okay. Yes, not a problem, officer. Hey officer, since you're here, uh, just help me out a little bit. Okay, so just since I got an officer help, just drop out. Alright, okay. You're not compliant, or? Then, uh, sit in the driver's seat. Shuffle. Oh, uh, I see. You realized this video is a half cage, didn't you? Yes, uh, I clearly did Much when better. I saw that. After everything, but you know. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's the door in the top in our fleet that have half cages. They're on the passenger side, whatever rods reason, I guess. Officer, how did, how, how did the, uh, did you get any CCTV? Uh, not really, I'm just now. I'm trying to well, ask you is, I know where I have a, I know where I have a camera that had its eyes on these vehicles. Mr. Langford. What? Mr. Langford. Mr. Langford, do you mind if I get the, uh, It's Langford, from your Mr. Langford. Area? But yes, you can, oh, you can grab Langford, the, so sorry about that. you can grab the, Weirdly, the dash cam for it, yes. Sir, um, okay, do you understand? Did, did, did you under? Do you understand that you have a firearm on you, correct, the whole time? Okay, give me one second. I gotta run this. Yeah, I do you Understand that you're supposed to inform any peace officer at any point of time during a stop or whenever they stop you to talk to you. Do you have a weapon on you? Yeah, the man just came up with his gun drawn. I was like, oh shit! I just put my hands up. Like, oh, okay. That 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 you guys arrest. I was like, oh crap. They happen so fast, man. It was just, it was just no time for this avocado and they shoot me. So you, and you also understand that it's a misdemeanor to not, um, to not inform and you can be sent to jail for it, right? I mean, I did tell you. You told me about it when I was searching you, sir. Yeah. That, that's not how it goes. You're supposed to tell the officer or anybody before uh, anything, even if they were shouting, as long as you shout that you have your weapon, you know, it, at least it clears you off the fact that you at least said it. But the fact that while well, I had my gun pointed to you and you had nothing to say to me about your weapon, you know, it it, it can go a different way, you know what I mean? Yeah, but last time I did that back on Forum Drive, I told the officer, oh my god, I got a he, shot. he like shot around me. Like, oh shit. What? Oh, okay. That I never heard. I never knew that. But uh, I'll see if I can look into that. But um, well, at the time, I'll I'll have to check with the uh, the primary officer as to what he wants to do uh, with your uh, with your citations or charges at the time. So just hang tight, real quick. Hey, but but I will tell you something. Hey, okay, come in close to that that and that guy over there. Don't hear it. What? <laughs> Facing me on the road, they went opposite lanes. He was swerving and out of traffic. He was flying over the railroad and everything, and he was going crazy. And I felt threatened for my life because he pointed that yellow thing at me. And that's why I was concerned around here because he was trying to tase me off my car. 
Wait, what and I, and you I pointed you. Uh, that that thing on your belt. I teaser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The thing with the long ass needle. Uh huh. Okay. And then I, uh, I'm coming in here, cause I saw the police, and I was telling the police, "Oh man, this guy suing me illegally on the road with his yellow lights." And then he started chasing me with his little yellow. And you're like, oh, get over! I'm gonna shoot you off! I'm gonna shoot you off! Oh shit! So I made okay, circles around so, uh, here. Let Let me just get this right. He tried to pull the taser at you on the public road on the public roadway, correct? No, in this here, and I'm like, oh god, he gonna shoot me! Oh, wait, so he pulled his taser inside the parking lot, or it was, or was it on the roads? Inside the parking lot, the road, away from him. Okay. Well, it, it'll be hard to do anything because if, if he works for a security company that also provides security for Mega Ball, then it will be a different story, but I will have to get with the uh, the primary officer and just inform him that. Yeah, uh, tell, tell him come here. I'll talk to him too. I was wondering where you were. Yeah, I'm attempting to get this dash cam footage from the like, six vehicles to load. Alright. Uh, another, another news, uh, the, uh, the individual in the back of the car did inform me that, uh, the security guy was driving in and out of the lane and opposite lanes as well as crossing on the train tracks, um, with his lights on, trying to chase him down, and I mean, uh, it, it, this is just for, you, for me to fill you in from what he just told me. And uh, he said when he got here, he the guy pulled the teaser on him in the parking lot and whatnot, so he feared for his life. Um, that's what he said. He didn't say anything about pressing charges or whatnot, didn't ask yet. But um, yeah, nah, he, I, I kind of reprimanded him about not telling about his weapon. So I think here's the. So I've already given the group six guy a citation for reckless. Uh, he uh -huh. works in a really tough. He works in a really tough area, to be honest. With you. Oh, and yeah, I, I mean, for part of that, for part of that, which I physically see, he was being chased down by these two people. So I think it was partially him trying to trying to stop them and get allow us time to get here, and partially them trying to go after him for not being one of us, I guess. Uh, and I did. Uh, I had my sense. weapon drawn at the guy in the, the little yellow the red thing. Uh, when he drew his taser, but the guy had ranked my vehicle. Alright, well, uh, his inf I got his information, uh, up still. It should be on my driver's seat. I put his, uh, wallet and everything there. I just wrote a book. If you, do, if you want to, do, to charge him for, or sign him for whatever, you, uh, his, uh, his information's all there. Alright, Dashcan cooperates. Looks like he tried to stop them to uh, shoot them off the property. Um, they ran, he called us and, and you know tried to keep an eye on them. Uh, then they decided to face him, he kept running back into the parking lot. That's when I showed up and this all went down. Uh, okay. I think your guy probably should get reckless at misdemeanor arrest. Uh, we'll leave that. We'll leave the pen citation. I mean, a guy in a security vehicle and an officer with a gun. I, I reasonably believe that he got. He literally forgot protocol on that. No, uh, uh, hey, I'm a sure thing. I'll inform him that he'll be being put under arrest. I'll search his vehicle in the quick set. Right. Never mind. Uh, yes, sir. I was just gonna say that uh, that guy is in the back of that car over there. Um, I those two it. individuals were very sketchy. I can't uh, hear you, man. I could I could hear them just talking just a little bit inside of the, the store and they said be quiet don't say a word so I think they were doing sketchy business uh, so you might want to search that little raptor right here he might have some some bad things in there yeah don't worry we'll search the raptor Anyways, him. Um, uh, make sure we find anything so I didn't really yes, get card back. Um, okay. identify myself so I just want to let you know I'm Lieutenant Tan with the uh, 
Los, Los Santos Police Department, okay? Um, what's gonna happen is, uh, at the time, at, as of now, you right, are here going you go. to be placed under arrest for Thank you, sir. endangerment misdemeanor. Thank you for your That's service, no sir. Right. Hey, wait, 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 wait. You wait. have to hold on. You're not gonna please bust that guy for police please impersonation. Hold on, hold on. Please right. hold on. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to have an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be appointed <laughs> to the state of San Andreas. Do you understand your rights as I have read them to you? Come here, yeah. Sanford. Take you a win. Uh, <laughs> well, yes, oh, that's well. great. I said, yeah. Okay, I'm good. Alright, sir. Uh, before we continue with this investigation, I'm going to be searching your vehicle at the time. Is there anything in the vehicle I should be aware about? Any weapons, drugs, or any illegal items? What? Well, there is about three small baggies of marijuana. How's like, going, ma'am? Green car. Hope you're okay, doing okay. There's my card. My name's Thomas. Okay. If you ever need any assistance, the... just let me know, okay? Be safe. I can't hear you, man. That damn man over there showed him loud. Uh, yeah, I uh, see behind my seats over there. That's a pretty big one. It's under the seat, so they fly away. Uh, can I just check? Is it dried or is it concentrated cannabis? What you say, buddy? Is it dry or concentrated cannabis? There's a difference between them on dry. Uh, like, you know, the one they have for the medical roll up the blunt? I would guess that would be dry? I'm not too, uh, I'm not, a, I'm not that much of a drug guy, so I don't know. I didn't know there's such a difference. Yeah, I'm just gonna search his, uh... Vehicle. He he did say he had about three baggies of weed. So I tried to ask him, was it dry or concentrated? He he, but he gave me the wait. Is there's a difference? And I and I myself went, I don't know. I mean, I just need to know. Right. Is it uh, uh, personal you, use you or intent to sell? I'll uh I'll weigh the uh, the baggies right now. Right, I'm gonna bring my car over here. Close the trunk. <laughs> also, I regret to import, uh, I may have damaged another challenger. first one was damaged uh, in the arrest of the person that shot at the chief. And more damaged on either. I mean... I can close Nye if you want to do his charges. What? I mean, I'll, I'll take it out. It'll, it'll be off the books if you, you know, I mean... Damages, so what? You know, you want to charge him? I, I, I can uh, not hear I about said, what happened. Every except bar. I know. Yeah, it's part oh, of it's the car. Expensive. Is yeah, I know. That little raptor did not do any damage to the car. It all hit, it all hit from the other guy. Oh. Which, um. Yeah, when he drifted into my vehicle. Don't worry, I arrested him. Eh, we got insurance. Now let's see how much does this weigh.
Hello? Yes, this is Thomas. How's it going, boss? Uh, yeah, I'm just here with the law. Alright, so three packages will be equivalent to about six, seven blunts, yes. I guess. So about one and a half grams each, or one gram. Well, it, so I had a crazy night here. Six blunts. Six, seven blunts, one per day. I mean, I think I need a raise. Yes. Yeah, I think I I think I did saw that he is a medical cannabis user. I need a raise. Oh, medical, the same. Medical. I just had to deal with two hooligans. Yeah, so I won't have an issue with that, I guess. Uh, I'll break this since he is gonna get arrested, anyways. Yes, sir. Yeah, bag it. Tag it. Yes. Let's get out of here. Bring up 742. Let me ask these <laughs> officers so I here. I can leave, sir. Hold Hold on, give me a second. Oh, uh, yeah. Let me. Officer. This vehicle real quick. Uh huh. I'm on the phone with my boss. Uh, is it okay if I go ahead and go home for tonight? Um, yeah, well, nah, you're good to you're good to clear off, sir. Okay, all right. Yeah, she said I could go home. Uh, I got the dash cam footage if you want to see it, but it was crazy. The car's not messed up or anything, though. Yes, uh, they were hooligans. They were all hooligans except for the officers. Go get a ride. Oh uh, yes, yeah. See, I had to. Yeah, I had to get on. See, I had to get on the road. Uh, which my amber lights and size stopped the two hooligans, and it was just it was crazy. Oh, uh, so crazy, boss. But I, I, I'll show you the camera footage. Ah, uh, yes, I got a ticket. But the officers were real nice to me, though. Yes, sir. <laughs> Alright guys, well, that's going to wrap it up. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. And I will catch you all on the next one. Roll the outro. Peace! Alright guys, well it's going to wrap it up for this video. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. If you are not subscribed, hit that subscribe button and turn on that post notification bell so that every single time I release a video, you guys get notified. Check out the links in the description for Twitter, Instagram, personal Discord where you guys can come chill, hang out. Check out the Twitch link in the description as well if you want to watch me live. I will be trying to switch it up. I put a new intro in the bidding. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. So we will be starting live streaming on Friday of next week. It is 5, 10, 2020 right now. So next Friday, we will start live streaming on YouTube. So get ready for that. With that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I will catch you on the next one. Keep it real. Peace.